person. Poor RBC quality causes a whole body hypoxic. With hypoxia, every cell across the body is to generate plenty of metabolic intermediaries, which eject these cells and get into the bloodstream ceaselessly. Since these metabolic intermediaries still hold the valuable nutrition, they would be reabsorbed in kidneys. The work of reabsorption surely consumes energy. Therefore, without rest, they put ever increasing workload to kidneys because they continuously undergo reabsorption process in kidneys as long as they circulate. It is obvious the more severe the hypoxia, the more quantity of metabolic intermediaries are generated from almost every cell across the body. These metabolic intermediaries ceaselessly bombard the kidneys by increasing the workload of reabsorption. On the other hand, kidneys themselves suffer from hypoxia as well under poor RBC quality. Mind you, kidneys consume more than 10% of total oxygen consumption of the body. Therefore, a mere tight oxygen supply itself put kidneys in difficult situation. What's more, ever-increasing number of metabolic intermediaries ceaselessly rush in to relentlessly increase the workload. This scenario is very likely to cause microcirculation disturbance in kidneys. As I explained in previous sections, the two factors work together to cause microcirculation disturbance. One, poor RBC quality. The other, increased oxygen consumption. Obviously, the problems above can be solved for good only by improving RBC quality. However, in clinical practice, no solutions have anything to do with RBC. For example, two commonly used solutions, kidney dialysis and a kidney transplant, have nothing to do with RBC quality, which means underlying problems are still remaining unsolved. Therefore, both of them can only deliver temporary improvement in renal function, with a kidney dialysis effective less than a week, and the kidney transplant effective several years. Therefore, both of these solutions is not a good choice. OTEC is the only best choice. For more information, you may visit my website here. Okay, we move on to next section. Hypoxia on liver malfunction. 